With the popular Yamaha N-Max 155 and Honda ADB 150, seconds closest in the minds of many, Suzuki Philippines can present its own competitors in this segment and compete with the 2020 Suzuki Bergman Street, the two domestic favorite scooters. Good opportunity to have. It's impressive, Bergman is a classic maxi scooter with a matte color stance and ergonomic fit. After spending time with a competitor in the Yamaha N-Max 155, the results were not surprising. It looks like the height and fits the chair, but a little lighter and a little more. Than N-Max however, you can still reap the benefits of tactile LED headlights and some LED taillights. There are still signs that use halogen bulbs, but that is not the question. The main beam is LED, which is impressive for the price of this bike. Suzuki 125cc engine combined with the required CVT feedback results with images of 8.58 horsepower and 10.2 newton meters of power. It's air-cooled and oil-injected, so you don't have to worry too much about oil lines or cooling pipes. The acceleration is good enough to give the rider the weight and weight of the bike itself, but agility is one of its strengths. If you are familiar with the scooter, it is very easy to navigate, turn around and turn around corners. However, I am not sure about the tire as it is a small one with a diameter of only 12 inches. The brakes at the front are small discs and at the rear there is a drum. This setup is fine, but it would be nice to have a drive underneath. But it's good that Suzuki offers a combined braking system for this bike. These systems help you stop more safely and faster than using just the front end. Unfortunately, there is no ABS, which is a bit acceptable considering the price, but it can still come in handy. This scooter saves a lot of space. It has 21.5 liters of available space and can fit any face quite easily. You get great seats for your passengers and good nails for them too. This is very practical because the seats are also wide. The passenger also has a comfortable and spacious seat where you can sit and relax. It also goes very well with parquet. We can imagine the bike making good maneuvers at low speed, even in heavy vehicles, with the saddle knowing the height and knowing the weight. It also has a 12-volt outlet for plugging in household appliances. Overall a very good maxi scooter which is not expensive. Sure, the Yamaha N-Max or the Honda PCX have more horsepower and a bit more of everything, but these bikes cost almost double the price of a Bergman Street. So this is a scooter to look at for the 76,900 pesos only. Thank you for watching. Hope you like the video. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to our YouTube and Facebook channel. Hit that notification bell to receive newly uploaded video. Keep safe and have a good day.